Okay, in this video I'm going to discuss a concern that a user had regarding the security of the Edge node, so stay tuned. Okay, first let me start by saying that the concern that was raised is a valid concern. Nobody wants their computer hacked into. Now, having said that, the Theta project has a world-class development team that follows industry standard security practices. They are very well aware of the potential for that to happen, and they employ every known method to secure the edge node, and to not do so would be suicide for them as a company to not protect their customers. Most reputable companies have what's called a red team. Sometimes it's an in-house team of one or two people, sometimes they farm it out to another company who specialize in this but their job is to to try to crack or hack a, a software package that is slated for release to make sure that any vulnerabilities are documented and closed so uh, I know this because I have 35 plus years in the software arena and I am very familiar with this because I spent the last 10 plus years of my career as the software configuration manager for the Navy's hovercraft and so I'm very familiar with the process of testing and validating software before it's released did it a lot and so I can speak to it as what is called a subject matter expert I hold the master certification in enterprise configuration management so I know how it's done it is important that software that is critical is tested to make sure that any vulnerabilities are taken care of prior to release because one of those vulnerabilities getting out can ruin a company it can bankrupt a company because they could potentially be sued. Now, with that said, however, the thing to take into consideration is, number one, when you are running an edge node, you should take precautions on your own to run a firewall and open what port is necessary for the edge node to use. That's number one, you should be running virus protection. That's number two. And number three, you probably should not have sensitive information on the computer that you are running the edge node from. If at all possible, the recommendation I would have would be to run the edge node on a dedicated computer with nothing more on it than the operating system required to run the edge node, period. That way, if someone were to breach and find a way through, there's nothing for them to get. You have responsibility for your own uh, sensitive data, and there are things that you can do, which I've outlined, to protect yourself. So hopefully this video was helpful to you in addressing the issue of security. And if you would, hit that like button on the way out, and I'll see you in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, please like it, share it, and most importantly, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.